Hello everybody and welcome back to Dinkum, where today it looks like Owen is back to say hello. Um, we sort of made a little area for farming. I'm hoping that's big enough. And I'm going to plant my first sets of seeds today, I think. Probably. Get that there. I probably have nothing like the right dailies for it today. Craft a new tool, cut down two trees and pet an animal. They're not even very big amounts, honestly. Rock on! I've got 100 for smashing rocks. Oh yeah. Petting an animal, easy. Some nice eggs there today. I want an empty hand though. I don't want to be trying to pet animals with a potential to hurt them. Or throw eggs at them or something. Okay, let's go. And get the chicken food. Harvest that lime tree as well. Chicken food away. And actually there's a lot of other things that I want to put away. Been very busy lately. Oh, guess I'll keep that Rupu. Did I take seeds out? Oops, I need my wheat seeds as well. So chickens are tended. Let's see how hoeing works. Okay. No, I think that's fine. I can do a three by three inside a... Yeah. So walking on them doesn't seem to do too much. Probably to be avoided if possible, but... Yeah. Got a right little homestead going now, don't I? Right little homestead. Ugh, let me plant. Thank you. Right, so now I need my watering can. It does seem to be full of water at the moment. To start me off. I make fertilizer out of rupu, but at the moment I think it's just important to be doing some farming. Um, so I've got enough for two batches of wheat seeds, and I think that's plenty for now. I'll probably be able to make some new farming plots um, over time. I'll probably just individually have like each one fenced off prettily like that. That seems quite nice. My apples are ready. Look at that. So no more walking halfway across the map to get apples. But I am seriously considering chopping down the apple trees and uh, making an orchard that's a bit more formal looking. It's taken a while to get them to grow up, yes, but... Um, at the moment, everything's everywhere in here and I, I don't like it, so I want to make it pretty and rose and stuff. I want to make this pretty as well and maybe have it just in line with the chicken coop. Or maybe a little bigger, I'm not sure.
I'm not entirely sure. I mean, both of those I could expand backwards. That might be a better thing to do. Have the front of everything at least flush. And then maybe expand backwards. Yeah, I like that idea. And just dig that out. So wheat apparently takes two days. Then I'm going to need to try and like work out how to grind it all up and stuff. Um, and that requires a windmill. So I'm not sure what to do about that then. But I think what I'll probably do first is make sure that I've got a, a, a good stock of like apples and things. But then what I'll probably want to do is... Um, I've got quite a lot of apples. You get three off each uh, apple tree. Three off each bush lime tree. I might go and try and get some more condongs and uh, bush limes. These trees here are condong trees. So maybe once they grow up and start giving me fruit, I'll save that up as well. And then I'll chop everything down and I'll redo the orchard in a much more... Uh, ...organised way. Let's put it that way. Probably would have helped to have done that to start with, but oh well, you live, you learn. Didn't really know how I wanted things at that point. On my little homestead. Okay, let's feed these trucks. So they will provide with the eggs. Okay, and then I think we need to go and see Irwin, Irwin and see about uh, what animal he's got in there today. Luckily it's another chick because I don't know what I'd do with anything else, honestly. Um, let's see if he's got a task because I do want him to move in if possible. He's at a quarter hearts still. I want to chat. What do you want to chat about? What's new? Have you ever gotten a gander of those bush devil, mate? I've seen more than a few. Crikey, they're real brooties. Yeah, they are. They're hard. Welcome to Owen's barn. How can I help? I don't want to chat. Need anything? Hey, would it be too much trouble for you to catch a blue fish? In the northern oceans. Oh, man. Okay, I'll try. Ugh. That's a baby chook. She's a cutie, right? If you've got a good home for her, she's all yours for 5,000. I'll give her a home. Great. Now, I think I should give her a name. Uh, Kardashian. Bye. That's so great. I've popped Gad Kardashian in this animal box. Please take her to her new home and release her. I'm going to miss her. Right. So, I think what's going to be important... Um, I can now make animal feeders. So I don't need to buy them. I think what's going to be important is for me to go fishing. So I'm going to release Kardashian into the pen. And um, so she's going to be without shelter for a minute. Ah, perfect. I can put the more food in there for her. Hopefully they'll just take from any feeder that's got food in it. They don't have to have individual feeders. So at the moment she doesn't have a home. But she does have... She has eaten. Um, I need to pet her though. I need to pet everyone actually. Okay. Very cute. Right, off we go. The first thing I want to do is to put back all of my farming stuff and tools. I need my fishing rod. I will take my pickaxe. I won't worry about my shovels or anything like that at the moment. I don't really need a scythe on me. Right, there's some stones. Those are all food. Ugh, I don't need my washing can on me. I need to take very good care of that. But yeah. Put away all the food. Hopefully I shouldn't need that.
Wonderful. So I've got some bush limes. I'm going to try and basically get a really nice orchard going, a really smart looking orchard. Um, so I'm going to save up the fruit to do that. And once I've got maybe you know, 20, 30 of each kind of fruit, I'll chop down all the trees. I'll replant them in a really nice order. So maybe like, well, how many have I got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven or so apple trees. And honestly, that gave me about 30 apples a harvest. So if I just did rows of either six or nine, even go all the way behind John's house actually if we kept it narrow enough definitely fenced it all in I have to say probably but probably in line with the chickens and then just really sort of really did a nice job of it okay so northern oceans so we want to go all the way up there, I guess. Just keep going north. Let's try it until I catch the right thing. Maybe I'll take a second fishing rod with me. Just in case. I really hope I can get it. It's, it's a blue something. I will... No, I, I don't want to talk to you. I just wanted to go and buy a fishing rod. I always think I gotta talk to the device though. Little thing. Thanks for your purchase. No problem, Mo. So, we wanna go to the right to the north. Avoiding the cassowaries. Uh, running away. Can't be bothered with you today, matey. Okay, heading north. Heading north. Let's see if we can find this... Uh, this particular fish that he wants. If I can't, I can't. Not the end of the world, I guess. But it'd be good if I could. And then he'd be so happy with me. I'll try this beach right up to the north and we'll see what we get. I'm kind of ignoring the shells at the moment because you don't get a lot from them. So I want some kind of blue fish, apparently. There's a few fish, like, running around here, but none of them are biting. Come and bite you. Nearly did it wrong then. Oh, you're a little fighter, aren't you? Alright, what are you? Blue spot flathead! Woohoo! That was what you wanted, wasn't it? I hope so. Or was that what Fletch wanted before? I'll go and check. What's the worst that could happen, right? Oh. Get eaten by a cassowary. Yeah, 
I'm thinking like putting some paths like going out across the world in general might be quite nice because when I go to to find things up north it'd be like really good. But yeah, just see let's let's see if that's the right thing. It, it was definitely a blue something he wanted. So I'm really hoping this is right. <laughs> Oh no, it's not. Oh. It's a blue fish. Good. You said I could find it to the north. I'm just gonna run through the cassowary thing. I don't care anymore. Stupid cassowaries. Don't think I'm not coming back for your drummers later. But if I keep some of every fish, uh, maybe if I keep a little fish stock, that might be quite a good thing. Come on, cassowaries. I, I don't want to play with you. Can't be bothered. This is where they're to the north, but they're in a lake or something. Oh no! I bet that was the one I needed as well. Stop it! Stop doing it on the first one! I don't expect that to happen! Oh no! Did I completely lose him? No, I didn't. Okay. Jellyfish was distracting me. That's my excuse and I'm sticking to it. You're very annoying. Try one more time. Come back. Oh no. I've just got this feeling that this might be the, the one, you know? I keep getting it the angle terrible. Come on, little fish, come back. Give me one more try. I really don't have much time to find you, okay? <laughs> yeah, then I lost that one. It's gonna get increasingly difficult to find. An oyster. Don't know what you are. I'll try and catch you, though. You're a feisty one, aren't you? These ones in the sea are very feisty. Oh, another one of those stupid flathead ones. Oh, 
See, they, they look really long, don't they? That was the one I was trying to catch before. He's a bit small, a bit more like these guys. So let's see what they do. They're getting a blue fish today. They look, they seem like they're quite hard to catch as well. It's annoying. Ah, annoying. Getting really late too. My cassowary is probably going to eat me or something. I don't even think you're the right kind of fish. I wonder if they're a river fish or a lake fish or something. Maybe I should try the lake to the north. The darker it gets, the harder it's going to be to see. And you kind of do need to see the fish in this game. Oh, here one comes. Okay, it went halfway across the pond. Jungle perch, yay. I am very hungry. <sighs> I guess, sorry Erwin, I, I tried, I tried so hard for you. But I think today it's going to be a case of I can't get your, your request, I'm really sorry. I need to go the other way. I always forget that fishing takes so much stamina as well. I don't take I don't have any food on me except there are bananas around, so let's see if I can harvest some of them. Because I don't really want to not be able to run past the cassowary. Baby ones and everything. See, this is why you leave the nests, I imagine. Um, get the map quickly. Okay, I want to go this way. Oi! You'd be messing with me. I would kill you, except that I can't be bothered, okay? <laughs> and so, we are back. And so I have failed in my quest, which really sucks. But I am definitely thinking that, um, like, I should keep one of every fish. Oh, I can't put fish into a chest either. Oh, man. That sucks. Okay, well, I think it's time for bed. That really, yeah, that was really difficult. And if I can't, if I can't keep them, I'm, if I can't keep them in a box, I'm going to have to keep them in aquariums on the floor, basically, which is terrible. So maybe just I'm going to avoid fishing ones from now on. If they want anything else, it's fine. Okay, well, let's see how my crops are growing today. I'll maybe just sell the fish I got. 
Owen is gone. I'm interested in how much the pearl will sell for too. We'll just do maybe a bit of... There's no visitors today, so we'll just do a bit of work on stuff in general. Let's have a look at the notice board. What's going on there? A crafting request. Uh, craft a crafting table. Reward, 5,700. I could do that. Shipping request. 20 cooked cactus figs. I can absolutely do that. Wow. That's a really good reward for that. And a photo request. I still don't know about photos. So, crafting table is made from what? Some wood planks, one tin bar, and nails. Why don't I have one of those at my house? <laughs> I really probably should. They're actually not that expensive. I think earlier on I thought it was really expensive, but that's actually not at all. So, tin bar nails and gumwood planks. Okay. I'm thinking I might buy a proper... Windmill, tin sheet, old gear, old spring, iron bar, and old wheel. Ah, I need an iron for that one. Drop trapped animals inside to get rewards. I'll have to look into that animal trapping malarkey, I think. Definitely. Brick path, two stone. Really? Well, I'll bring down. I'll bring down some stone then, shall I? I'm thinking a brick path might be nicer than a rock path for maybe for my sort of um, workshop area. So I need to bring a bit of tin back. I'm gonna just go and sell some stuff to John. So good. I have a pearl. See you all up. I can offer you 5,000. That's amazing. Thank you. I'll also, I may as well sell the fish. It's going to be too annoying to keep, honestly. There you go, John. Lovely. Back up to 21,000. We owe 70,000. So I'm going to take some stone over and make some brick path. And I'm going to make this into like a little brick area, a little brick patio. And again, I'm gonna make. I'm gonna change the shape of it slightly so that it's more in line with the house as well. In the same way, I've got that fenced off. In the same way, I think I want to do that with this. So I'm getting more of an idea of where I want things to be, which is quite nice. Take all my stone. Oh yeah, let's put the shiny stones into the grinder as well. See what comes out. Wow, that takes a lot longer. Oh, that's pretty. I get more than one thing out of it. In all. This is exciting. Yeah, two tin ore and a opal. Nice. Opals are very Australian, aren't they? They do a lot of opal mining in Australia. Um. Yeah, I guess I'll just leave that to it. Is that a ruby or something? Oh no, it's copper ore. That's 
Very nice. What am I even doing right now? I'm supposed to be making a... Getting the tin together to make a... um. I actually have already. And then gumwood planks as well. It was nails, wasn't it? Nails, um, like three gumwood planks or something. And then a couple of pieces of tin. I can't remember how much tin though. So we shall see. I have enough. So what well, how much tin was it? I I forgot. One tin and three nails. Okay, so I'm gonna make some of the tin into nails. I'm gonna make myself a crafting bench. I'll give that to Fletch. I want Fletch to like me. No, there's you, love. What can I do for you? Uh, let's chat. I completed your request. Bonza, you crafted one crafting table for me. I did indeed. There you are. Thanks a lot, she love. When I put up that post, I knew you'd be the one to pull through for me. Here's your 5,700. I got some permit points as well, it looks a bit. Oh, picker, here's a milestone for try diving for treasure. Fishmonger? What are fish doing in the ocean when they could be put to good use lining your pockets? Here's a milestone for selling fish. Okay. Anything else? Oh, harvest master! Picking fruit and logs off the ground will get you far in this place. Here is a milestone for gathering up lots of stuff. I only got 50. That's fine though. Okay. So the next thing I need to do is to get myself 20 cactus things. So the best place to do that would probably be across here. In my little desert area. I mean millions of cactus across here. So I need about 20 and I need to cook them, give them to John for an easy 14k. It's already been harvested. Right, here we are. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, thirteen. Three more. Sixteen. Eighteen. Twenty. And and these cook fairly fast on my little grill, so that's really cool. I'm loving having the bridge. The bridge is super helpful. Provided I remember where it is. It's over there. Hello, Rue. Right, so another thing I need to do today is to expand the chicken coop a little bit and to make a new home for my little tiny chick because I didn't do that yesterday. And that's kind of fine. But I don't know how long the animals will, will go without um, shelter for, so I need to just be a bit careful about that. Let's barbecue these cactus figs and then the rest of the day will be spent we start cooking copper because you need quite a few copper for it. And it 
takes a while to cook. Probably having more than one smelter would be helpful. Probably having the big smelter would be super helpful too. Spending the money on that might be really useful. But I could spend it on the town and getting the town debt down, but I, nobody likes me enough yet to move in anyway. So why not spend it on things that are going kind to of make my life easier? cooked cactus figs for John done I'll also ask him if he's got any other uh, quests for me it's nice when there's not a visitor on the I island sometimes because then there's no like pressure to spend an entire day looking for one fish or something I did that thing for you you really got the shipment ready for me sure did yeah thanks a lot Sheila you really saved me I didn't think I'd get that shipment filled Here's your 14,000. Yay! Oh, it's two hearts for John now. Welcome to John's Goods. How can I help? I wanted to chat. I wanted to chat about. Got a job for me? Oh, actually, I have a green cardigan dress. I don't want any more. Do you want to buy it? All right. How are you doing business with you, she love? A warm cardigan dress. All right, let's have a look at the cardigan dress. It is green, not purple. It's uh, quite cute, I guess. I think I think it's not really meant for the Australian climate, though, is it? Really, no. So this is worth the uh, twenty, thirty thousand. That's a furnace, a faster furnace. It can also process iron ore. Mm -hmm. Very good. There you are, thanks for your purchase. There, for purchasing the cardigan dress, I got a quarter heart as well. But I'm kind of thinking that that might be a nicer... A better way to process all. Having more than one furnace is useful as well, you, you know, and the fact that that one can do iron. I think it's worth it. It might be a little bit early on to buy it, possibly. Maybe. Right, I'm going to go get that copper ore that's just past the cassowaries. Oh, yeah, that was actually quite quick compared to the other one. It just stopped as I walked away. I probably do need to poke you guys in the face with a spear at some point, don't I? With that particular cassowary nest, I may actually get rid of their nests. I might break their nests down. Just so that they're not such a pain in the way all the time. I'll see how I feel about that. Knew I saw some copper around here. So much more copper uh, that I'm able to get for so much less of a hit to my stamina. It's very, very nice. Ooh, the more shiny stones. I really do need to put the, more of those through the grinder. As well. I have a feeling, you know that episode where I kill the, the Rue? I have a feeling I'm going to be very disappointed with trying to get a thumbnail for that, even though it was such a cool and awesome episode. Because there will be no good angle, I imagine. When you're fighting something, it's really hard to think, oh, yes, I'll just get a good angle for my... Oh, no, I'm dead. You know? 
You think you're getting a good thumbnail angle and then suddenly you're dead. It's not good. Well, that was a good start. Got some... A couple of bars worth of copper there. Nearly four bars worth of tin as well. Probably need to run around the uh, the thing a bit as well. Run around the uh, uh, what's it called? The uh, desert a bit. Get some stuff in there. All right. Then. So if I'm Smelting up stuff, I may as well. I think that's enough for the chook, chook house anyway. May as well stick a shiny stone through. Maybe getting some more grinders would be good. I think I'm alright though. Oh, did I water my plants today? And do they need a water? They probably do. I didn't notice myself get any farming levels. Um, but I still have to see. Have a look at me details. Farming, still level zero, so... I'm wondering if I have to wait Nice. Thank you, shiny stone. So wait till harvest to actually get the points. I really need to make like a feeder and stuff as well. Because I've got a two chicken set up and three chickens. It's not actually ideal at all. feeding i like to have as many feeders as i have chickens i think it's uh that's more ideal to be honest Okay, let's go and see what it takes for a chicken and for a feeder. Do I have my scythe on me? No, I don't. I can't remember whether it's just spinifex or it's spinifex resin. I have some resin put by, but not the actual spinifex. So. Um, it says spinifex tufts, four copper bar, two tin sheets, three gumwood plank and four nails. Okay. I'm going to have to double check that. You know what I'm like. To double check everything. So there's some copper there. Uh, more copper there. There's enough tin for my tin. And they're going to have to be made into tin um, sheets instead of just tin. Then I need to get my side out. I've got the copper, I've got the tin. I need three gumwood planks. I'm getting through this gumwood at a fair rate, aren't I? I need some nails. A 
apples. In effect, it's tough. So I actually did have some. Um, I don't remember what else. Let's see, let's see if that's enough. I'll have forgotten something. No doubt about it. Right. Chuck house. No, I actually have everything I need. Nice. Chuck feeder. Two palm wood planks. We'll grab those. I'll go and put down the bird coop first, though. Oh, that's one happy little chicken. Putting on palm wood plank. Times two. I know, I've been ignoring my dailies for ages now. I'll try and get back on top of them. I just keep having other things I need to do. Right, so animal feeder, craft. number three and I want to do loads of cosmetic things and I keep having to do functional things as well so I am aware that that's a thing that keeps happening I just have them all in a line basically I think I just keep expanding this out and some food I don't think I picked up any more food when Erwin came in. I'm going to have to do that. Next time he comes, I'll have to get a load of food. So much food. Sort those out. It's looking quite nice though, isn't it? Now, I did say I was going to take all of my stone down to the crafting area. In the tent. I made a road to this and I never use it. I always go as the crow flies. So what I wanted to do is make some uh, brick path. Paths or something? Wet thumb. Watering plants. Nice. Hot fruit. Cooked fruit sounds gross, I know. It might be. Anyway, here's a milestone for cooking fruit. Savvy shopper. Nothing wrong with spending some hard earned dosh. Here's a milestone for spending a, a hundred thousand dinks. There we are. Fish catcher. I caught ten fish. I'm crafting crazy. I've crafted 50 things. Look at me go. Okay, so now I can just uh, try and make a nice little area. Now I said I was going to make it sort of in line here. This is basically going to be my crafting area. I might even fence it in, I'm not sure. I may make it a bit longer as well. I'm going to move a few things to be in this in this particular little little brick bit. Okay. So I'll probably, I'll probably put things on, to, I don't know if I can maybe, no, I can't put it under my house either. Nice try, Shelab, nice try. Got to move things before you can put things on them, so. That would probably be happening at some point. And then I want to make some kind of fencing. Uh, 
I don't think I've got any fencing left. I want to make some fencing for the orchard as well. Let's put that up there for a sec. I know I've got a total in inventory full. I can't move anywhere until it's uh, sorted, but. Let's have cooking on this side. So I'm going to just move my grill and this little oven, little kitchen oven. Up over here. I'm also going to move the cooking table. Kind of next to it as well. Yeah, it needs to be longer, definitely, doesn't it? Then pick this one up. Leave that maybe here or something. Uh, may as well have the other furnace like next to it. Why not? Pull the stone grinder forward and the table saw forward. Then unfortunately I need to try and move the boxes, which is always a pain. There, aren't we looking a lot nicer? I think so. I think that's gonna be much better. So I'm gonna start to pick away some of these. But I'm going to stop running out of uh, stamina pretty soon. Actually, sooner than I thought. It is now 8 o'clock at night, though. So maybe we'll finish this up in the morning. Um, we've got happy chickens all in their little coops. I've got nicely watered, hopefully. Oh, they don't look very watered to me. Do I need to water them multiple times a day? Oh no, maybe they are watered. I'm not sure. We'll see in the morning. But that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, every day I look like this. It's, it's not very good, is it? I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. I will let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you. I need to get to bed. I'm signing off and I'm not even in my bed yet. Let's see what kind of uh, skills I got. Of mining. Still no farming yet. So I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.